Hello, good evening. Good evening. How are you today? Fine, thank you. Okay. Very good. cold. <laughs> what, <laughs> what happened, Suli? It's very cold. Oh, yes, it is. Okay, I'm sorry. Yes, it's, well, here it's very cool. I have to close the door and everything. And yeah, because the wind was very, very cold. And, but it's nice. It feels good. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. With chocolate. Yes, hot chocolate, right? Hot, hot chocolate. chocolate. Yes, and hot chocolate and oh, with milk. Oh, it would be yeah. very, very delicious this time. Okay. Um, hey, Freddy. Hi, teacher. Okay. They told me that they fixed the problem today. Yeah. Okay. I started to, to work in the exercise. Okay. In the Perfect. exercise. Excellent. Yeah. Okay, good. Thank you. Then, uh, hey, Enrique, we have Enrique here. How are you, Enrique? Uh, fine. And you, teacher? Good. How are your hobbies? No hobbies? Uh, yeah. Read. Read okay. uh, fiction. Fiction read. What are you reading now? Uh, 19... 1990. 1990. Sounds familiar. Me suena, me suena ese libro. It's Asimov. George. It's Asimov. Asimov, right? It's about robots and stuff like that, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Um, okay, good. And Urania, how are you today? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Good. Hi, thanks. Energy. Yeah, I'm With cool. Energy. No energy. No energy. <laughs> ah, okay, vamos, te vamos a hacer una, una dinámica right now, okay? <laughs> okay. Everybody jumping, okay? Everybody jumping right now. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna play some music, some rock and roll, and then we're gonna dance right now. Okay, so then we have Norma, Carol, and who else? Okay. So, Let's see. <clears throat> okay, this is for us today. Where were we? Okay, she's very tall. The descriptions, right? Yesterday we were using in some sentences to describe people. Okay, this is the repetition of this conversation. No se escucha. Yes, thank you very much. Okay. Okay, now yes. Hello to all. In this lesson, you will listen to a conversation between two people describing another person. <clears throat> Adjectives of appearance will be practiced. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes. Her name's Ashley, and she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, right? She won't tell me. I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay. This is like, she won't tell me is como... Eh, no me ha dicho, right? Que nunca me lo diría. Okay, that is something that... Wait. No, we don't need you. Thank you very much. Okay. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes. Her name's Ashley, and she... 
Okay, and then it says, I don't know, she won't tell me. Okay, this is and like she wouldn't say that, okay? No me lo va a decir, right? Unless, uh, unless probably you ask her. Okay, so this is an expression that is in, that's want is the negative form of will in the future, right? So it says she has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell. Okay, for example, uh, you can say, Tony had a, got a new job. Oh, really? Yes, and how much is she gonna earn? ¿Cuánto va a ganar? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay. Then you can use this expression in different contexts, right? Uh, for example, uh, hey, uh, Enrique won the lottery. Oh, really? And when is he going to change the bill? I don't know. And he won't tell me. ¿Cuándo voy a cambiar el billete, right? I don't know. Mm, I hope so. <laughs> And he won't tell me, tampoco me va a decir para que no lo vaya a esperar, right? Not to, to get the money. Yeah. Okay, so then this is, she won't tell me, he won't tell me, he won't do it, okay? He won't do it, he won't say that, okay? You can use the expression. Okay, what else? I guess then this was... Oh, she won't tell me. And there are some expressions here, like my son is very tall and white skinned. Then we have here, um, my name is Juan Carlos, I, to say, I am uh, of Italian descendants. My height is average, my eyes are gray, and my hair, my hair is color light brown, or light brown. You don't need to say color. You say my hair is light brown. Okay, uh, Freddie, can you read this instruct uh, this objective here? Sure. In this lesson, you will learn how to describe, ask, and answer questions about appearance. Appearance. Okay. Ask and answer questions about physical appearance. Okay, so here we have describing people. Hi, in this lesson you will learn how to describe, ask and answer questions about appearance. Let's go over the audio program. Notice the questions they use to ask for the information needed. Describing people. General appearance. What does she look like? She's tall with red hair. She's gorgeous. Does he wear glasses? Yes, and he has a beard. Age. How old is she? She's about 32. She's in her 30s. How old is he? He's in his 20s. Height. How tall is she? She's 1 meter 88. She's 6 feet 2. How tall is he? He's quite short. Hair. How long is her hair? It's medium length. What color is his hair? It's dark brown. It's light brown. He has brown hair. When you want to know how someone is physically, we use what look like. For age-related questions, we use how old. For height, we use how tall. The rest of the question will depend on who you're talking about. Okay, and I sent you the, did I send you the document with the appearance? one okay so then this one is about comparatives 
Okay, here. Let's find another one. Sort of slow this one. Okay, so here we did uh, general appearance. What does she look like? And then does he wear glasses, right? This is when, when, the, when the question is what does he or what does she look like? You have to use all those phrases, expressions that will give the other person an idea, right? Of the physical appearance. But when you, there are some specific questions like how old is he, how old is she, uh, about the height, okay, how tall is she, how tall is he, and also about the length, okay, how long is her hair, how long is his hair, how long is my hair, how long is your hair, so those are more specific questions. And the other one is what color, what color is his hair? Then look at the answer, it says it's dark brown, it's light brown, but we don't need to repeat color in the answer, okay? My hair is color brown, or my hair is color light brown. No, just the color, okay? It is light brown, okay? And then we say here, he has brown hair, he has black hair, he has dark hair, and we use all those descriptions. Okay. Questions in this moment? No. No, no teacher. Okay. So then we're going to answer these questions. Write questions to match these statements, okay? Here, the key, la clave es ver la respuesta, right? My brother is 26 years old. What's the question? What's all? What? How old? How old? Uh -huh. How, How old? old are you, How old? brother? How old? How old? Color. How old? How old are you? How old are you? Your brother? Your brother. Okay. Your brother. Yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. We have a contradiction there. Okay. <laughs> how? How old? How old are you, brother? How old? How old? How old are you? Does. No, uh, how old? No. Your brother. How many brothers? One brother. One brother. Okay, how old? Brother. Mm, the birth? Yeah. Your, your brother. Your brother. No, the birth. Mm. Ah, how old is, how old is your brother? Is, okay, ah, how old is, how old is <laughs> your, your brother. brother? Brother. Brother, okay, good. Okay. That's better, right? How old is your brother? Mm -hmm. How old is your brother? Okay. <clears throat> okay, how old is your brother? There you go. Uh, when you answer this uh, exercise, don't, don't, uh, don't put the question mark, okay? Because the question mark is here. A veces okay. este, cuando lo están respondiendo ponen la pregunta y ya por eso les da malo, ¿ok? Yeah. Porque ya está, right. ajá, porque ya está aquí el question mark. Ya está. ¿Ok? Entonces okay. solo, how old is your brother? ¿Ok? Then, I'm 173. What is the question? Oh, hey. Oh, how is... How old is, is your... How, how tall? I am. I'm, I'm 173. How is your tall? How 
we... How, how tall is he? How tall are you? How tall are you? Oh, how tall. How tall are you? Remember? How tall are you? Ah, because oh. it's talking about you. You are the second person. Uh -huh. And how then you say, you? how tall are you? How tall is he? Okay, how tall is Joel? How tall is Enrique? How mm -hmm. tall is Areli? And then mm -hmm. if I don't use the names, if I don't, then how tall is he? How tall is she? Then, and how tall are you? Okay, second person. The answer is I am. Okay, remember the, the key, okay, is the answer. Look at the answer. I am. Uh, now, yeah. Sharon. Sharon is what? She. Uh, she. she. Okay. So then Sharon has brown hair. Okay. How it, color? She. What color? What is color? color? What color? What color is? Hair is she? Is her hair? Is her hair? Is her. Sharon. No, she her. It no, could be, right? It could be. Her hair. Hair. What's that could be one question. Color? What color is her hair? Is her hair. <laughs> okay, that okay. could be one. What is another possibility? Uh, what color is Is her hair? Uh -huh, that's one. What color is her hair? Is there another possibility of another question? The possessive. Mm -hmm. What Sharon's what Sharon's color what hair hair, hair, hair. Is her hair. Okay, let's see. What's okay, what color, color is, is Sharon's hair? Is her hair. Uh-huh. The pos uh -huh. The possessive, remember? Yes. Uh-huh. What color is Sha del cabello de Sharon? Mm -hmm. What color is Sharon's hair? Eh, si, los que, eh, cuando me dijeron what color is her hair la pregunta está bien pero si yo le pregunto ahorita al grupo what color refiriéndome a alguien del grupo what color is his hair a quién de quién uh, me aquí tengo uh, a tengo a Joel Enrique could be Freddy Okay, David, right? We don't know. But if I say what color is Freddy's hair, then it's easy for me to identify, okay? So that's why. So la otra pregunta está bien, but no in this context. No para este contexto, right? Good. So then we have, yes, the color is hair. Okay, good. Number four. No, she doesn't. She wears contact lenses. No, she doesn't. She wears contact lenses. She does. It's a question. Okay. Does? Does she? Does she, uh, she wear wears contact lenses? No. Mm -hmm. She okay, does okay. wear contact lenses. Does she use glasses? It could be. It could be Freddie. Yeah? That's it's, it's a good question. Okay. Or Urania, does she wear contact lenses? That she wear. Okay. Who said that? Ah, okay. Normal. And does she wear? Does she does she sunglasses? Lens. Does she wear contact wears, lenses? Does she wear contact? No wears because it's a question. Does she wear? Okay, does she wear? Because does she wear uh, uh -huh. lens? you look, you say wears in the affirmative sentence. Oh, okay, wears. But in the question, does she wear? Less. No, okay, without S. Okay, without the S. What is wear? Wear, I wear glasses, uh-huh, look. Use, I use glasses. Okay, I wear glasses, I use glasses. Okay. All right. Next one, 
He's tall and very good looking. He's tall and very good looking. Who is he? How, oh, how, he, does, how, is he? how does he look who, like? How, who how is, is he? Who is he? Who is he? Who is he? He is Tony. Okay. Oh. How is he? He's very well. Thank you. How he? How is okay. he? For example, depending on the question that, that you use, changes, right? Because if you, if you say, uh, who is he? He is John. How is he? He's very well. Then the question here is what? What does he look like? What does he look like? Ah, what does he look like? The appearance. He is tall and very good looking. Okay. What does he look like? What does he look like? Okay. Next one. My sister's hair is medium length. My sister's hair is medium length. How long is her hair? Okay, how long is her hair? How long is your sister's hair? It's okay. Then you say because it's more specific. Lo vemos a lo mismo, right? Este más específico que say how long. Ajá. Porque si digo, how long is her hair? Ahí tengo Zuli, Arelini, mm -hmm. right? And Hello. Urania. But if I say, how long is your sister's hair? It's more specific. Your sister. Okay. How long is your sister's? Eh, recuerden que how long significa también cuánto tiempo, right? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Pero del contexto aquí es, how long is your sister's hair? Largo. Ajá, está el hablando de, de tamaño, de longitud. De tamaño. Ok, good. I have dark brown eyes. I, la respuesta es yo. Bless you. Ok. So, almost Friday, Arely, almost Friday. Como, como les dije que le iba a vivir el viernes, va. Yeah, getting ready. You need it. Ok. So, I have dark brown eyes. I have dark brown eyes. I have dark brown eyes. Mm -hmm. ¿Cuál, ¿Qué me tienen que preguntar para que yo responda? I have dark brown eyes. How? What color is your What eye? color is my eye? Oh, oh. Is no. your only, only one eye? <laughs> Or two. Hey, hey. What, what color are your eyes? Color. Okay, what color are two? Are your eyes? Your eyes. Ah. Because what, what color is your eye? This one is blue and this one is green. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a two, right? What <laughs> color are your eyes? Only cat. What color uh, are your eyes? Yes, I have dark brown eyes. Okay, in reality they are they are green, right? They are green. Okay. Color are your eyes. Your eyes. Your eyes. Okay. Your eyes. Okay. Uh-huh. What do you say, Sully? How old are you? How old are you? Okay. Mm. Ah, that one, yes. How old are you? How old are you? Y se pronuncia how old are you? How old are you? How old are you? How old are 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 you? 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 Exactly. Okay. They are nice, beautiful, and very tall. Okay. What does she look like? What does she? But it says they are. Look they like. are. Uh -huh. uh, 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 uh. Yes. 
what they are nice, beautiful, and very tall. So, let me see. Okay, this is singular. Mm -hmm. What does and, it do? And this is plural. What do? No. No. No do they. No do they. What do? Uh -huh. what, what do they? Look they. Like? What do look they? Like? Okay. What do they look like? What do like? they look like? They look okay. Like. Uh -huh, because it's do, it's not does. Mm -hmm. Does he, do they look like? Okay. They, they are nice, beautiful, and very tall. <clears throat> and the last one? Um, how, how tall, tall is he? Is he? How tall. Mm -hmm. Okay, you see how tall about the height. Uh, aquí, how tall is he? How tall is she? How tall are you? Sí. Okay. How is tall he? is he? Yeah, podemos hacer incluso, how tall am I? ¿Cuál es mi estatura? How tall am I? And then you are 170. You are 172. Okay. Uh, how tall is uh, Enrique? How tall is Sully? How tall is Tamara? How tall is Joel? How tall is he? How tall is she? Okay. See, es la misma estructura for all the questions. Para todas las preguntas. How old are they? How, old are, how tall are we? Que tan altos somos, right? Then, uh, what do they look like? What do we Okay, what do we look like? What do you look like? What does he look like? What does she look like? And how old are you? How old is he? This one, how old is, how old are, how old are you? How old is, how old is he? How old is she? Okay, si tiene un perrito, how old is it? Si no le sabe que de qué género es, right? Sex. You say, how old is it? How old are they? How old are they? Uh -huh. I have two children. How old are they? They are 10 and 7. They are 15 and 20. Okay. Uh, what color are your eyes? What color okay. are your eyes? Uh -huh. What color is your eye? No. Okay. Are your eyes? Okay, a menos que sea que solo tengo uno, right? A one eye person only. Okay, what color is your hair? Okay, what mm -hmm. color is your hair? What color is your skin? Okay. Skin. What color? Uh, what color are your? What probably your? Your teeth. Okay. Uh, yellow. Uh huh. Yellow. <laughs> yellowish. Yes. Uh, what color? Uh, let me see what else. What color is your, your what? Your nails, maybe if you if you if you if you, if you polish them. If you, if you polish them, you say what color? Okay. Then the next one is uh, how long is your sister's hair? How long are your sister's eyelashes. You know the eyelashes? Yeah. Pestañas, right? Then, uh, how long are your eyelashes? Okay, eyelashes. eyelashes. Uh, how long is your, how long are your arms? Okay, there are some basketball players that look like elastic, right? <laughs> how long are your legs? Okay. For example, if you remember Michael Jordan, he was very long. Very, very tall. Uh, very tall, but very long arms and very long legs. Mm -hmm. For example, there are uh, Julia Roberts, for example, she has very long legs. Mm -hmm. Okay, but that and some other people uh, have different sizes. Okay, 
what does he look like? Does he wear glasses? Does he have a mustache? Does she wear? Does she wear glasses? Usa glasses, right? Does he? Does she? Do we? Do I? Por, teacher. Uh -huh. ¿Por qué usa wear? Usar. Significa igual que use. Mm -hmm. mm. But more, more, para cosas así de prendas de vestir o accesorios, wear. is wear. wear. Ah, mm -hmm. okay. Aunque se puede usar use también, ¿verdad? Pero uh -huh. más común es wear. Que se usa como un sinónimo. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. Wow. What color is Sharon's <clears throat> hair? Remember this possessive, right? ¿Se acuerdan de este posesivo, verdad? Yes. De, de Sharon. Okay. What color is Sharon's hair? ¿Qué color es el cabello de Sharon? What color is uh, Sully's car? What color is uh, Norma's house? What color is Joel's uh, shirt? Okay, mm -hmm. so then you're gonna use the possessive. And after that, is if, for example, if you say, what color is Joel's chair? You say, oh, it's uh, gray. Okay, what color is her, what color are his uh, earphones? Okay, después de eso ya podemos usar his, because we are talking about Joel. What color are his earphones? Oh, yeah, they are white. Okay, what color is, uh, for example, his hair? It's gray, okay, and like that. Okay? Then, how tall are you? The height and the age. Okay, just uh, remember these questions, practice them a lot, remember. How tall, how old, how long? Okay, then for example, for, uh, for height, age, and longitude, we're gonna use how. How long, how tall, and how old. Then in general questions, what color is your hair? What color is Sharon's hair? Or what does he or she look like? Now let's see. We have to test the answers. We have one problem here. Probably is the... What color is Sharon? What can it be? What color is... Probably... The apostrophe. Mm -hmm. Maybe. No. No. What color? What could it be? It's mm, here. Uh -oh. Yes, yeah. the key. No. When it's based in the she? in the Charles and Ayers. Uh-huh. It's based in here. Yes. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Oh my god. Ah, ah. <laughs> okay. Así es. Mm -hmm. No. Oh, it's a still. Yeah. Mama, yeah, but that one. It has to be that one. Ahí está. Yes. Sí, ese. Yeah. Yes. El yes. espacio. El espacio. Mm -hmm. Okay, what well, color? Mm -hmm. Sharon's here. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. el espacio. Yeah. Okay, so. The ties, okay, pero cuando sirve eso también. What color? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. There you go. Hija, son calzones. Tuyos. Sí, míos. <laughs> okay, I thought you was talking about the hair. Okay, good. 
Now, our next one, see we have here, the exercise about color, how long, and questions. To talk about, it says participants will listen to a description of five people in order to develop participants' listening skill. Okay, good. <clears throat> Listen to this. <clears throat> come on, come on, come on. <clears throat> Listen to descriptions of five people. Number them from one to five. One. I think Brian's good looking. He's pretty tall with dark brown hair and a mustache. He's about 30. Two. Tina's 18. She's got red hair, shoulder length, and very curly. And she always wears interesting glasses just for fun. Three, Rosie is pretty tall for her age. She has long blonde hair and wears contact lenses. She just turned 10. Four, Tim's about 23. He's fairly short and a bit heavy. His hair isn't very long. Five, Alice is very tall and she's got long black hair. She's around 25. Oh, and she's very slim. She looks like a fashion model. Okay. Listen to descriptions of five people. Number them from one to five. One. I think Brian's good looking. He's pretty tall with dark brown hair and a mustache. He's about 30. Two. Tina's 18. She's got red hair, shoulder length, and very curly. And she always wears interesting glasses, just for fun. Three. Rosie is pretty tall for her age. She has long blonde hair and wears contact lenses. She just turned 10. Four. Tim's about 23. He's fairly short and a bit heavy. His hair isn't very long. Five. Alice is very tall, and she's got long black hair. She's around 25. Oh, and she's very slim. She looks like a fashion model. Okay, so that's the description of these five people. Listen to descriptions of five people. Number them from one to five. One. I think Brian's good looking. He's pretty tall with dark brown hair and a mustache. He's about 30. Two. Tina's 18. She's got red hair, shoulder length, and very curly. And she always wears interesting glasses just for fun. Three. Rosie is pretty tall for her age. She has long blonde hair and wears contact lenses. She just turned 10. Four. Tim's about 23. He's fairly short and a bit heavy. His hair isn't very long. Five. Alice is very tall and she's got long black hair. She's around 25. Oh, and she's very slim. She looks like a fashion model. She's very slim. All right. What about Brian? 
I think Brian is what? Good looking. Good, Good looking. looking. Good looking. Okay, has a nice appearance. Um, what about his? Pretty tall. Pretty tall. Very pretty tall. Tall. Okay, pretty tall. Uh, with dark brown hair. And what? Red. And Hi. beard. Beard. And? A beard? Beard. Mustache. Beard. Mustache. Oh. Mustache. Yes, mustache. Tina's 18, and she's got what? Red hair. Red hair. Red hair. Shoulder length. And very curly. Very curly. Okay, very curly. And she always wears interesting glasses just for fun. What about Rosie? Rosie's pretty, pretty tall. tall. Pretty, pretty tall, tall, pretty tall, tall pretty for pretty her tall. age. Pretty tall for her age. And she has. Long, long light hair. Long? Hair long. Long, long hair. Long light hair. Long hair. Long hair? Mm -hmm. long, 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 long blonde long. hair. Okay, long, long. Long hair. The color. Okay, long blonde hair. Long, long, oh, long, long. Themes about? When Very, very long. Very long. Okay. Wait a minute. Fairly very short. short. Fairly short, like kind of short. Uh -huh. And a bit. Eat. Okay, now I think that we need to Listen again for that part. For you to refresh. Listen to descriptions of five hair and wears contact lenses. She just turned 10. Four. Tim's about 23. He's fairly short and a bit heavy. His hair isn't very long. Five. Alice is very tall, and she's got long black hair. She's around 25. Oh, and she's very slim. She looks like a fashion model. Okay, so he's a bit... Heavy. Heavy. Heavy, yes, heavy. And Alice? Very tall. Very tall. She's around 25. Oh, and she's very? Slim. 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 Okay. She looks like a fashion model. Okay. Very slim is in very good shape. Okay, so they are all correct. You see, sometimes you need to listen three, four times because there are, in this, this kind of exercise has a lot of information, okay? The it's similar information, but about different people. That's why, you know, you need to, to have a good memory, a good retentive, and listen more times, okay? Questions about vocabulary? Mustache. Mustache. Uh -huh. Mustache. Okay, the hair that we have for men. Uh, right? Okay, okay. The mustache. And this thing, curly? Curly. Curly. Rizado o colocho, right? Oh. Curly. Curly. <laughs> ¿Se acuerdan de los tres chiflados? Yes. <laughs> Al pelón le decían curly, right? Risitos. Risitos. Ah. Era risitos y no hair. Ah. Uh -huh. mm. 
Okay. It's like, remember Popeye? Popeye. Popeye, se recuerdan de Popeye, le decían. Yes. Okay, era Pop. Tenía un ojo más altón que el otro. Yeah. Y por eso se llamaba Pop Eye. De ahí oh. venía Pop. Se escribe Popeye, right? But it was Pop Eye. Okay. Es de Pop okay. Eye. Como que ojo saltón, right? <laughs> so that was, they have the, the names. Tenía una relación con algo, los names, right? Slim, teacher. Slim. Mm -hmm. Delgado, right? She's slim. Oh, okay. Okay. Slim. Okay. Slim, slim, slim. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, good. Heavy. Heavy is like. Mm -hmm. uh, they like uh, fornidito, right? Heavy. Mm -hmm. Yes. Cholit, Fine. cholito. <laughs> Chol um, yes, Carol. Fine, fine, fairly short. Oh, fairly short. Fairly, fairly, fairly short. Fairly short. Fairly short. Algo bajo, right? Fairly okay. short. Fairly short. Yes. Buena nit. Fairly short. Algo bajo. Ajá. Algo bajito. Mm -hmm. Fairly short. Long blonde hair. Es como cabello mm -hmm. largo y rubio. ¿verdad? Long blonde hair. Sin el como. Ajá. <laughs> long. Ok. Long blonde hair. Long. Okay, good. We're doing good. Okay, uh, let me see here. Then this is, but I don't think we will. The other one is modifiers with uh, prepositions. Just let me show you this. Which one is she? For example, we're gonna use uh, let's see which one is she. She's the woman wearing glasses over there. She's the one which in jeans. One she? Uh, which one is she? This is all, all also give you descriptions. For example, uh, for example, who is uh, let's say if you see in the picture, who is Noel? Okay, Noel is the one. Well, in my screen, no sé si lo tiene igual, is, is this the one next to Tamara? Yes or no? Where is Noel? Or who is Noel? Next to Tamara. Next to Tamara, right? Yes. Yes, and then you say Noel is the man or the boy next to Tamara. Okay, uh, and let's say, for example, who, who is, uh, let's say, Enrique? Oh, Enrique is between Freddy and Carol. <clears throat> okay, between Freddy and Carol. So you give some uh, references, right? Some prepositions uh, to give, uh, let's say, uh, to identify a person. For example, who is Arely? Oh, Arely is the, the lady in red. <laughs> Yes, y no es la canción, la lady in red, la, la, señorita, okay. la señora de rojo, la chica de rojo, right? mm -hmm. in red, in this picture, okay? And who is Betsaida? Oh, Betsaida is the girl eh, who is smiling, okay? In the picture, right, smiling, mm -hmm. all right? So then you give a, a little detail about the person and then the person can identify. Okay, so this is always you not know, trying to describe some people. Good, and I have a question here. Okay, good. Can you see the screen in this moment? No. Okay, just let me. Okay, uh, I hope, I hope uh, Suli is ready for the. Okay, Suli, are you ready? 
No, teacher. <laughs> But I know. Not today, okay. Eh, Alguien que quiera. El documento que le no le llegó, no le pasé el documento de la descripción, de verdad. No, no. No. Uno mandó ahora el teacher. Pero ese era de compartes. Yes. De los comparativos, ¿verdad? Comparativos. Yes. Sí, pero no era, no era el que vimos ayer, ¿verdad? No, no era el que vimos ayer. No. Ok, voy a menos es que no sé what happened to that one okay one minute yo creo que se me confundió con otro comparatives comparatives yeah but I don't want that one and then we have <coughs> When you done, be uh -huh. done beautifully done, exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it's not that's not the one that that we need. People appearance. This is the one, I guess. Es que me da error al abrirlo. Yo creo que Something happened to the file. No, the committee has to be it says, but I haven't, but I haven't opened it. Okay, well, I, I will look for it. Weird, very, very weird. Okay. I don't know why they sent the other one. Okay, good. So then, uh, then we have the descriptions. When we say, for example, uh, who, uh, when you when you see a person in, let's say, in a corner, say, who is John? He is the man, the standing. Okay, next to the window. Okay, so here you are using prepositions to identify people. Okay, who is Joel? Uh, Joel is the man sitting in front of the books or the bookshelf. Okay, he is in front of the bookshelf. Okay, okay, now uh -huh, he is the man. Oh, behind? Uh, no, he is in front. The oh. books, the books are behind her, behind mm -hmm. him, sorry. Mm -hmm. Okay. Behind his, Yes. Uh -huh. And then he's the man sitting in front of the bookshelf. Mm. But, uh, for example, Noel is the man wearing a black jacket. Okay, a black jacket. Right, so this is, you know, for example, the, the way that you're going to give also descriptions. So then, and we use this vocabulary very frequently, right? For example, when you want to know uh, who is, for example, um, who is, uh, I don't know, who's Shakira? Who is Shakira? Okay. Is, is the, <clears throat> she is a singer. She is a singer. Uh -huh. She's the, uh, yeah. she's a girl or she's a woman who sings. Yes. Rock and roll. She's rock. a woman. Uh -huh, who sings rock and roll. Uh, she's a woman who is married to a famous uh, yes. soccer player. Soccer player. Uh -huh. She is the woman uh, <clears throat> who is from Colombia. Okay. Or oh, she's a Colombian singer. Okay. So these are, you know, uh, also words that describe, okay, the, what people do or how we can identify other persons, right? Then, what else? What other kind of description can we give? Can 
Can you remember? Oh, this is mine. And let me see, for example, he would say, who is, who is Thor? In the Avengers, who is Thor? Uh -huh. uh, he In, is a, he is a man. He's the guy? The, he is a guy, the, uh, Thor, uh, Trenu? Uh -huh. Yes, but uh -huh. but the description he is uh, he is tall. He's he's a tall. He's tall. tall. Uh -huh. He's he very handsome. Very handsome. <laughs> yes. And he's a. Uh, uh, he has a. He has a, a mustache. He has yes. a mustache and a beard, right? And a beard. Oh, okay. and a beard. Uh -huh. Black skin. He is a skin. Black? No, skin. White. White, uh -huh. white, white skin. White, white. white skin. White skin. Okay. White. All right. Uh, and her here, no, her is blonde. Long hair. Blonde long, hair. Long, long, long hair. hair. Long, long, long hair. hair. Yes. And the eyes? The eyes. Uh, Blue eyes. Blue eyes. <laughs> Blue eyes. Okay, Carol. Okay, Norma. Very good. <laughs> you have all the information, right? <laughs> okay, good. It's the man with the hammer. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, you see, this is very simple and practical. Yeah, he's the man with the hammer, right? <laughs> he is in the corner. Okay, he's the only man. Okay, this is a good, a good one. He's the only man who can lift the hammer. Yes. Okay. Oh, he's the man with the hammer. Perfect. Okay. And, they, yeah. and everybody okay. understands that, okay? Who is Iron yes. Man? He's, who is Iron Man? Iron. Uh -huh. Iron. Who is Iron Man? Iron Man. He's the man. He's the man he's with the, the suit. He's the man. He's the, the man with the suit. The man. With the iron suit. Okay. He's the man with the iron suit. Okay. He's the man who invents weapons. Mm -hmm. who creates weapons okay so you see this is a how you can also describe and give he's some, a million he's a millionaire millionaire yes. millionaire uh -huh. he's a mil yes he's a millionaire he right? he has a lot of money yes okay what else um <clears throat> uh, he is a uh, he has a mustache. He has a he has a mustache, and he is a, a skill. He's a white skin. White skin. White skin. Yes. He's very funny. Right. Yes. He's, he's very. And funny. very crazy. And very mm. crazy. Uh -huh, yes, he's very, yes, yes, he's the crazy one in the movie, actually, right? Yeah. Yeah, the one who's doing also crazy things. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. So then that's the, that's the video that we're going to watch tomorrow, right? So then about how to describe people and identify people in a place. Okay. okay. All right, teacher, people. Teacher. Yes, yes, Carol. Teacher. No, me no. Oh. We can also say ah, that Norma. Joel B we can also say that Joel Bichet was what boys more masculine. <laughs> the, the muscle, the muscle man. No, no, no. Boys more masculine. Ah, masculine. Um, who? Boys. Uh -huh. Boys. Who? Uh -huh. La voz de de. No, but who? <laughs> ah, <Es> muy... <laughs> very mas very masculine. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah. You know that the other day, the other day, I was going to ask uh, Joel if he has been a. Uh, an announcer, he has worked on a radio. No? Joel? <laughs> Never? <laughs> on, on TV? Never. Uh, yes. Yeah, because no, no, he. No. Never. Tiene voz de, de, de locutor, de right? Locutor. Yes, uh -huh. no, I like it. Uh, TV <laughs> announcer. Yes, no, 
Yes, whenever when he speaks uh, in the oh, sound. Oh, thank you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Thank you very much, everybody. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Okay, thank yes. you very much to all. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's right. That's what I'm going to. I was about. I just a punta de preguntarle estaba right. And oh, I, I forgot it. Also, but I forgot it. Yes. Oh, okay. no, what do you say, Alberto? Yeah. Parece noche de amor. A radio, a radio oh program. Un <laughs> programa de radio, right? Yes. Uh -huh. yes. Okay. Correct. Let me say, Nights of Love with Coel Beaches, right? <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. Okay. Bye bye. Okay. So see you tomorrow. Bye. Have a good night. Bye. See you tomorrow. Okay. Tomorrow. See you. Take care. Bye. <laughs> Bye.